What's good, YouTube? It's your girl Shay, and welcome back to day seven of Vlogman. Today's video is going to be a DIY Starbucks drink recreation holiday edition, and I have some hot chocolate that I'm gonna be whipping up for you guys. I'm also gonna make some whipped cream from scratch. Shout out to Tinny for showing me how to do it. I really hope that y'all have been liking Vlogmas this year for me. And if you are new to my channel, don't be afraid to hit that subscribe button. All right, let's get right into it. Okay, so I got this drink from Pinterest. And all I did was like type in DIY drinks, hol DIY holiday like drinks or whatever. And I got this caramel brulee hot chocolate i guess if you order this at starbucks you can get like hot chocolate with two pumps of caramel brulee sauce whipped cream and then caramel caramel brulee topping on top i don't have any toppings so we're not going to do that part but we are going to do the caramel sauce and then the whipped cream i have heavy whipping cream inside of the fridge and i'm going to get that out when it's time i also have boxed hot chocolate I am not that skilled to where I can make hot chocolate from scratch. I don't know how to do that. But I am going to show y'all how Tini did it on her TikTok. Um, where she added heavy whipping cream into her hot chocolate mixture. To make it like syrupy. So I'm opening up this box of hot chocolate. And I'm going to make two because I'm going to make my mom some. So I need one cup of milk. So here's my one cup of milk. I'll do two cups obviously because I am making some for mom i'm gonna let that kind of like simmer for a few minutes just so we can get warm i have it on the um big big eye so it should get like it should start getting warm fast i feel like a real deal like chef type of girly because like we're just going in now i'm about to take this hot chocolate packet and just empty it into the milk because it's starting to get warm I have a lot of stuff planned, like a like movie night for her and things like that. We're gonna make some more hot chocolate. We're gonna make some schmobars. We're gonna have a cute little nice setup. This doesn't even feel like it's getting hot though. I am just pouring and whisking just to make sure everything gets like evenly distributed. I do wish it was darker, darker, but I don't have any like chocolate to put in here to melt for color all right so while that is like kind of cooking down i'm gonna pour the heavy whipping cream into here and teeny said if you just whisk it should turn into whipping cream so i'm just about to start whisking Maybe I'm not doing it right. Hold on. Ugh. I was not going to sit there and try to blend. Whisk no more because it wasn't even going. So I just bought the handy dandy. Oh. It's starting to work. It's starting to thicken up. That's crazy. It's giving it you've never made whipped cream from scratch and it shows. Ah, this is live. <laughs> I'm gonna take that off of that because they said online, if you continue to like have a high speed on the mixer then it's gonna start to turn into butter now teeny did not tell me that i had to to cool it off before i started to try to whip that's not something that mama teeny told me to do so i didn't know that until i looked it up online so i definitely did put that back in the freezer all right y'all 
All right, y'all. So let's start to get it together. But now I'm about to add the caramel on top. <laughs> Here it is. Hot kakalaka. Let's taste this. And then after you finish, you always want to clean up your space. So let's start doing that. All right, y'all. Here is the finished product. Oh my gosh, this is so good. There's so much whipped cream, <laughs> but it tastes so good. Mmm. Nah, this is good. It's crazy. All right, y'all, that is it for this video. I hope you enjoyed this DIY Starbucks hot chocolate. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and I will see y'all back tomorrow for vlog miss day eight.